Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here on the Iron Man Profile. Today we have a mining fiesta, and it didn't go how I wanted it to at all. It was rough, I'm gonna be honest. I missed the first half. I was out of the house with stuff that I just couldn't avoid, so that was brutal. And we ended up not even mining Ruby. We did a little bit something different, and honestly, I don't really have any regrets. I'd say it was kind of worth it, but you guys can be the judge of that in the comment section down below. But without further ado, it's time to stop rambling, leave a like and subscribe, and let's jump right into it. Super quickly though, if you do ever find yourself checking on the high store whether it be for an ongoing seasonal bundle over a tailor shop maybe you need some skyblock gems for an upcoming fire sale or some booster cookies or you just want to pick up a rank don't forget to use my career code on the high pixel store when you check out to save five percent on your purchase it is code zach spelled just like my name z-a-c-h type that in on checkout you'll actually save five percent on your purchase and it's a great way to support myself and the channel and i do greatly appreciate everyone using my career code on a regular basis you guys are seriously so amazing but without further ado let's jump right into this very wonky mining fiesta okay we are doing the Mining Fiesta, um, not exactly in the normal place where you guys might always see me do the Mining Fiesta, and I have a reason. I do have a reason. The next Mining Fiesta will not be the same as this one. Oh, 20,000 glass eye powder from a lapis corpse? Don't mind if we do. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I was out of the house, um, way too long this morning. Like, actually way too long. I had some, uh, real life stuff I had to take care of this morning. And it went way longer than I wanted it to. For me, the Mining Fiesta started at 12.55 p.m., it's currently 3.55 p.m. We basically, I've been mining for like the last 20 minutes and just been able to kind of tap in now. Also, I have an umber key for this dude. Uh, what we got? We got a scrap, 12,000 class I powder, and that's about it. Not gonna lie. Uh, I'll take my scrap at least, but, um, yeah, I missed a lot of the mining fiesta. And, uh, it was not on purpose, obviously, and not ideal, but since I only have like two hours left in the fiesta, a little over two hours... I figured I don't really have too much time to uh, do everything I want to do. So, basically, I'm doing the new update for the last little bit of this fiesta. I need to stockpile on some of the new gemstones. I need to get a ton of glassite, so I'm just trying to do as many commissions as possible and get mine shafts and kind of go from there. And powder. also need a lot of powder. I actually have 180k that we can go ahead and dump into the tree really quickly. But yeah, today didn't exactly pan out the way I wanted it to in terms of time I had for everything. But sometimes it's just like that. So a mining fiesta, unfortunately, we're kind of dropping the ball on. But there is another mining fiesta tomorrow night from when you guys are watching this. And I should be able to mine for the entirety of it. Or at least that's the plan. It starts at 7.55 p.m. my time. So you guys will see a regular scheduled mining fiesta video where we hopefully get like 200 something million coins as per usual, and uh, kind of refresh the bank, because the bank the bank needs some uh, refurbishment, to be honest. But, yeah, just going to be doing some um, commissions. I'm going to try and level my Mammoth Pet a decent bit. It's level 87. Ooh, I actually could level... Ooh, you know what? Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to level my Goblin Pet. I'm going to level my Goblin Pet. It's a mining pet. I have, like, zero XP on this thing. It's level 1. Uh, let me go and take out, like, 500k so we can buy a mining... Uh, XP boost over here at Zog really fast. Uh, he's always hiding in the bushes, but there we go. Let's go ahead and grab out our goblin pet because this thing will level up really quickly. There's a good chance we can get it decently close to level 100 legendary in this one fiesta and like the last two hours here, which would be great. So yeah, level one, uh, we'll, we'll keep this guy up updating and um, hopefully leveling up relatively fast, but yeah, just uh, today didn't exactly pan out how I wanted it to. So I figured I'd try to make them Seven levels from one block? Okay, yeah, he's gonna level up quick today. That is gonna be very nice, but yeah, didn't exactly pan out the way I wanted it to today, so still gonna do our best to take the most of it, make the most of it, and I just need a lot of these new materials. Like, I actually need a ton, so yeah. Gonna grind this out. I'll cut back with some updates as well as when we get some um, mine shafts because we're looking for some crystals. Big ones we're looking for today, I'm gonna be honest. We're looking for Citrin and Peridot. We don't have any crystals of those two gemstones, and we desperately need them. And commissions are going to go twice as quick for me today, unless I can't find any spawn Citrin, because of the Mining Fiesta. And we're getting two times gemstones and ores, so it should be really good. should be super chill. We'll see how much XP we go up to. Right now, we're at 51 of 100. We've gone up one Skyblock XP so far. But yeah, let me lock in. Let's see what we can do. Okay, since we last checked in, it has been half an hour, um, which isn't that long. And we equipped our God pet this thing is skyrocketing in xp we are halfway to level 100 i think level 92 is the halfway point if i'm not mistaken but um yeah 13 out of 25 million in half an hour is disgusting that is 
genuinely insane. Um, pretty happy about that, can't lie. Obviously, not too much Skyblock XP at the moment, which is a little tragic because, uh, honestly, it's just it's just hard for us to get XP. We're almost at, like, 10 million Glassite Powder, if not already past it. So uh, you do go up very small amounts of XP when Powder Grinding. Like, for the last little bit of XP we have, how much XP do we even have left? Let's go and take a look. Skill-related mining. Uh, oh, yeah, what is that? I mean, 75? 75 XP left. That's really not much over the course of um, 10.3 million powder we still have to gain. So, yeah, it's it's not going to be the best. Like, 10.3 million, let's say it was evenly distributed, which it isn't. It's just going to get worse. That would be basically 1 XP every 140,000 powder. So, uh, not amazing, but um, something we have to do. It's, it's got to get done at some point, and I want to be able to max out everything in the mining skill, and this is a part of it. And this dude... Is on my, it's just, it's just on me, please, back up, back up. A little bit of personal space, didn't hurt nobody. But yeah, I'm just over mining at basically every gemstone. It goes so quick. We should have a nice little stockpile of various materials that we've been needing recently. Also, some of the gemstones, so we can actually make some perfects, which is gonna be super nice. But pretty happy with uh, where we're at and how things are going, I can't lie. Obviously, just gonna keep on going and pushing through all these commissions. But man, I still can't believe how much mining XP we have been getting. It's actually insane. Also, I have kind of gotten lost. I think I went, went the wrong way. I should be able to fix it though. Yeah, come out to the side. Go around here, warp back around, down to the bridge, down below, Citrin. Here we are. Beautiful. I get lost sometimes. It's okay. It happens to the best of us. So about another 40 minutes after we hit halfway with the pet, I actually just hit level 100. And it got a lot faster than I thought it would to get there. So unfortunately, we missed the exact moment. But we can go ahead and take this thing out of our pets menu really quickly. Slap it back in as another three Skyblock XP. And that means we've gone up six Skyblock XP today so far during this little mining session. And now that that's done, I'll go back to leveling up the Mammoth. We'll see how far we can get this thing. It's already level 88, but obviously since it is a combat pet it's not going to go up mining xp as quick uh miracle and the mine fiesta as is though are so good for um mining xp because of the 60 mining wisdom that comes with miracle and then also another 75 mining wisdom during the event so uh yeah it kind of goes it just goes insane i mean i literally leveled a mining pet to level 100 in just over an hour which is Kind of ridiculous that that's even possible, but I'm happy it is because uh, otherwise I don't know when I would have leveled that, that goblin pet. So nice to have that done and out of the way. And now we can focus on some of the other pets from the update. But um, yeah, glad I decided to do that. I could have just stuck with my Skatha for like the most efficient thing. But since we're doing so many commissions and honestly, like the commissions take almost no time because of Miracle as well. It just goes so quick. I considered we, we may as well just keep our pet equipped the whole time. And I'm going to do the same thing with this mammoth pet, uh, try and level it up as fast fast as we can but yeah just gonna keep on chugging away we got 44 minutes left in the mine fiesta unfortunately but uh we'll see how high of a level we can get this thing up to and how much powder we can get in the meantime we also have another 286,000 glassite powder though that we can go ahead and use so let's go ahead and do that really quickly also been doing my chocolate factory upgrades but let's go into our heart of the mountain tree all the way up to the top i really want to max out this perk increase your chance of finding suspicious scrap in a mine shaft let's go ahead and max that out and then, honestly, I think I'll work towards upgrading this all the way just because of how much uh, glass that you need. Like, I need this as high leveled as I can. So, three more levels that left on that. Not too bad. And we also have a powder gas. Let me go warp forge really quickly so we can actually take care of this thing. Really close to maxing out this beast jerry, something I've been working on the sidelines. So, yeah, let me take care of this and get back to mining. Then I got a vanguard room, and I have a perfect plate. I don't have any forge slots open right now, and I don't have a skeleton key forged up. I wish I did. I really wish I did. I was literally thinking about it too. As soon as I filled up my forge, I was like, I should have made a skeleton key just in case I get this guy right here. And we did. Um, and unfortunately, I don't have a skeleton key ready to go. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. We have so many to open and we'll have to find so many more of these things. So it, it's not the worst thing, but uh, who knows? This could have been our pendant. All we know, it's hiding inside that NPC right there. So it is what it is, but uh, yeah, I'm going to get out of here because I got other things I want to mine besides glass at the moment, but still a little tragic when you see it and uh, you don't have what you need for it. So it is what it is. And there we have it. The mining fiesta is now complete. Uh, I have some bad news I have to deliver to probably a lot of people on my island. Island too laggy to join, but GG's on mining fiesta. Yeah, I didn't mine for money. Um, 
Let's go to the island. Also, our mammoth is lo now level 94. Okay, it's... Oh, my island's actually just restricting people from joining. Oh, my goodness. Um, hi, fellas. <laughs> How we doing? Look at the whole game. You guys are too cool, man. Uh, I, oh, the mute... Do you guys hear the stereo pants? Oh, my lord. I need to stand back here. I need to stand back here. <laughs> Hope, hopefully, everyone's doing well. Uh, let's do ping wars really quick. I always like doing some of these social games for people who come and visit the island, but... Oh, we're winning. Thank goodness. Last time we actually lost. Um, yeah, I have some bad news for these guys. I, I literally did commissions the entire time. We went up 8 skyblock XP. We're now 39th again, which is super nice. And 1,242 XP away from level 440. Or in other words, 13 levels. Um, actually, how much more powder do I have to dump into my tree? See, the thing is, as much as I was grinding for powder, we really weren't getting that much powder. You know what I mean? So, uh, it is what it is, uh, unfortunately, but we, we, we did do our best. So, let's go ahead and max out this perk, actually. There we go. And then dump some into Strongman. Uh, we still have 10k left. Can't really put anything on that, though. And so, yeah, with 10k more, we're basically at 10 million glassite powder, which is pretty cool. Halfway there. Um, yeah, fellas, I got some bad news. Um... I didn't mine Ruby. Not only did I not mine Ruby, I missed the first two and a half hours. Tragic. Yeah, tomorrow though, I will be mining Ruby. And um, yeah, I missed the first literal half of this fiesta. Um, big sad, big sad. It, it, it's very tragic, but I'm still quite happy. Literally in an hour, we leveled a level one goblin pet to level 100 legendary. So that was super sick. Our mammoth also went from eight, level 88 to 94 near the end. So this one's getting pretty close to level 100. And then after that, um, yeah, I have, some, I have some other options on what I can level up. And it's probably going to be one of these new pets like Ankylosaurus. Honestly, I'll probably do T-Rex after. T-Rex is just such a sick pet. I can't wait to level that thing. It's just It's going to look so cool. Uh, but yeah, sorry guys, no Ruby today, but I'm, I'm still happy with what I was able to do in the two and a half hours I had. Okay, I told the fellas to come with me, because I actually need to check the Inferno minions. I think it's been a full 24 hours since we fueled them last. Apex, please. Please, Apex. Uh, okay, predictions for two hyper -gallics. So let's see what these guys think we got from our two hyper minions in 24 hours. They had eye drops. Um, I, I don't know what more type of love they, these guys want from me, okay? Some people are saying three vertexes, one vertex, five vertexes, four apexes. If I get four apexes, uh, like, I'll, I'll actually, like, uh, buy this guy, like, a free trip to, like, wherever he wants to go. Watch, I actually, no, that would be actually be insane. I'd be down, honestly, if, if it happened. That would be just be too crazy. Here we go, though. Let's check the first one. No way, dude. This minion is starting to get actually shameless. This one hasn't produced anything in days. Please tell me this one made up for it again. Oh, that's a bad sign. Oh, it's such a bad sign. Dude, two hypergolics, nothing. Oh, what is today? Drum roll. Let's see. Literally nothing. Literally nothing. Sag, it, it's tragic, it's tragic. Dude, two more fuels just spent and nothing in return. That is actually insane. Genuinely insane. So I need to go grind some eye drops for later tonight so I can actually fuel these things again. Actually, so sad. Uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. It's okay. We move. We move. Also, it is now the next morning after the mining fiesta, and there's a couple things I can go ahead and put into my forge. I started a refined mithril because I needed one more so that I can make two more mithril plates here really soon. Uh, I have everything else I need, including the two enchant iron blocks, obviously, just in my sack. I have three mithril plates here, but once I get this, I'll be up to five, which is enough for five more skeleton keys. I just need to make some more uh, tungsten and umber plates, which I'm going to be starting a few of those as well. But first, I want to actually go ahead and take this slot right here. You might notice this perfect plate that's on me that we finally forged up. And uh, we can go ahead and make ourselves another skeleton key. So let me get that cooking up. Crazy. Um, hopefully, this one's better than the last, in all honesty, but... Only one way to really find out, and that's by using it. So we have that cooking away. Um, actually, let me run over here quick. Sorry, I'm like, I think I'm like less than 10 uh, powder gas away from being done with the beast area, if I had to guess. So I'm, I'm doing my best to try and kill as many of these as possible until I don't have to kill any more at all. 
Okay, not quite less than 10, but 12 more after that one. So yeah, only 12 more powder gas until I'm finally done with this bestiary, which is going to be super, super nice. Uh, we're getting really close to that. It's a, it's a really tedious one, but luckily having like all this Dwarven Mines content again has like kept me around here so I can actually kill them. So that's been honestly uh, on, on the good side. So I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. But what we need to do is basically make as many glass eye amalgamations as we possibly can. So... Luckily, we were able to mine, uh, I mean, I had like no enchanted glassite before the mining fiesta yesterday, so I didn't focus glassite too much, but we, we have a decent amount saved up, 1100 enchanted. Um, we need four stacks per glassite amalgamation, so that's enough for one, uh, two, two, three, four, three, and I think that's all my forge spots, but when this one opens, I think I have enough to actually go ahead and start a fourth, so that'll be very, very nice, but we're going to go ahead and grab out some onyx, aquamarine, citron, and peridot. Just like so, and we're going to go ahead and get three of these bad boys cooking up because I need them for tungsten and ember plates, like, very, very badly. I want to get, like, a bunch of skeleton keys going, so that'll be super good. Um, one thing that does suck is I still just haven't found a citron or peridot crystal. Like, I just haven't. Maybe my path to getting them will be through some skeleton keys. That's what I'm kind of hoping for, but so far we've, we've been kind of... Uh, yeah, we've been a little on the unlucky side, which is a little tragic, but it happens, you know, it's okay. The one problem is, though, is that right now I'm mainly aiming for one of each for my accessory, obviously, my Relic of Power. I really want to slap those in there so this thing goes up the rarity, I get my Skyblock XP, and some extra stats that are pretty good. Um, that's why I want those, but... Uh, that's not where the Peridot, for example, or the Citrin is really going to end. Like, Citrin, I, I would only imagine that in the forging update, I'm going to require a bunch of it if I want it on, like, a good forging set and, like, the new tools or whatever comes with that update. I'm assuming it's going to be it's gonna be needed. So I want to try and get some perfects made before that update inevitably comes, and um, I'm just not getting any of the crystals. And then when it comes to um, Peridot, uh, I mean, I need perfects on my entire set of um, Fermentos as well as my rancher boots, to name a few. That's eight pair that I need right there. Not to mention the farming tools. Um, some of these, like, fully maxed ones have three slots for Peridot crystals. So, um, yeah, I need to start getting some Peridot crystals so that I can actually start forging them into perfects and putting them in my, in my equipment. But, I mean... I guess I'll probably end up trying to put a flawless in every single slot, and then if I get crystals, obviously upgrade those into perfects. Um, that's probably what I'll end up doing, but we're going to end up with a lot of flawless for a very, very long time. So that's a grind we're going to have to do in the relatively near future, because I kind of want to delve back into farming a little bit. But um, yeah, one thing at a time, right? So... We're working towards more skeleton keys. Once we get these three glass eye amalgamations, we can make another umber and tungsten plate. Once my skeleton key's done, I'll start a fourth glass eye amalgamation, so we'll be able to make two more of each. And then I'll just be able to make two more skeleton keys, so we'll have three on hand, which will be very, very nice. We also have this perfect aquamarine that I don't know what to put on yet. I'm kind of waiting until I have to go and do my next fishing grind, and whatever I need it on, I'll slap it into. I mean, I'm assuming I'm just putting this on my... Actually, I, I could probably just do this now. Just slap it on uh, a piece of Magma Lord. You know what? Yeah, let's let's just slap it on a piece of Magma Lord. Why not, right? This is probably is probably what I'm putting it on. Worst case scenario, I can always take it off. But let's actually go ahead into the hex with this thing. Slap in the chest plate, gemstones. Uh, oh, they're evil. They are evil. You need to unlock the slot. Okay, well, we, we can do that quick. Let's go and unlock one of these slots. Gemstones. Swap over the fine, grab out some aquamarine, slap it back into the hex. I didn't even realize you had to unlock these slots. So that's a lot of aquamarine that adds up for, I mean, eight aquamarine slots across the four pieces. Especially the flawless for the second one. That's kind of crazy. But let's go and unlock that. And we're going to slap on a perfect, just like so. That looks super clean. And uh, that right there is giving us an extra 2% sea creature chance, which is kind of insane. So that's just from one perfect. Like once we have eight perfects on this thing, that's 16 sea creature chance. Not to mention we can actually put some on rods as well. So pretty nice. So unfortunately, that is going to do it for today's video. Our mammoth also has been leveling up a little bit since. Been doing some commissions this morning. And I can happily report that we are now over the 10 million powder mark which is pretty exciting if i don't say so myself we're at over 10.1 million powder so 9.9 .9 million to go great so close and for so little xp too like we just we don't have much xp left from this update but that's what it's all about just completing the small little tedious things even when you think you're done with something so 
We have a lot of crystals we're going to have to get. I'm honestly not too worried about maxing out the powder. Uh, we're just going to get there. We're going to get there. We're going to be well past it. As you can see, we're kind of well past uh, gemstone and mithril powder as well. It's just one of those things. We're just going to continue to add up. And uh, yeah, we've been leveling our pets a bunch today as well. So um, not exactly the mine fiesta I wanted, but the mine fiesta I got. However, the, the next mine fiesta at the time of recording today's outro starts in 8 hours and 45 minutes at 7.55 p.m. my time tonight. So this one should be a lot better. I have some stuff I have to do outside of the house today, but I should be back in time to get all set up. Mine some ruby for like 5 hours, so should be all good. We really need the coins, but hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys did don't forget to leave a like and subscribe use code zach whenever you find yourself checking out the hypixel store join my discord in the description down below so you don't miss out on anything going on in the ironman profile and without further ado i'll see you guys in the next one take care and peace out